Well, hello and welcome to uh, this exercise on probability based on a past exam question by Edexcel. And it says there are only red counters, blue counters, and purple counters in a bag. The ratio of the number of red counters to the number of blue counters is 3 to 17. Sam takes at random a counter from the bag. The probability that the counter is purple is 0 0.2. Work out the probability that Sam takes a red counter. Okay, now there are two methods to doing this now. The first method, the first method is purely arithmetic. The second method involves a bit of algebra. Okay. Yes, so here we go. The probability of picking a purple counter is 0 0.2. Yep, as shown here in this little tree diagram here. Which means that the probability of picking a red or blue is now 1 minus 0 0.2, and that will give us a 0 0.8 as it got there. Okay, so now it then becomes that the probability of picking uh, from one from 20 counters, which, which which is composed of red and blue counters, is 0 0.8. Okay, so now it then becomes a question of proportionality here. So you then do so the probability of picking a red counter then becomes 0 0.8 divided by 20 because we got. Uh, the red and blue counters, there are 20 of those together. So the probability of picking three of picking from a red counter then becomes 0 0.8 over 20 times 3, which then gives you 2.4 divided by 20. If you multiply the, uh, the, the um, hang on there, <laughs> sorry. If you multiply the uh, numerator there, and denominator here by 10, you get 24 over 200. Okay, and when you cancel out, excuse me, there, when you cancel out, we just get rid of that and get rid of that as well. Okay, you can divide 24 by 8 and 200 by 8, you get 3 over 25. So that's the arithmetic method. Now, method 2. Is the algebraic method here? Okay, okay, uh, excuse that. Okay, now I've said here let the ratio of purple to red to blue be x to 3 to 17. We know 3 to 7, we know 3, we know 17 already, we don't know what x is. So the whole idea here is to try to find the value of x. So if you add x plus 3 plus 17. You get 20 plus x there. So the probability of picking a purple counter is x divided by 20 plus x and that's 0 0.2. When you cross multiply, you end up with x is equal to 0 0.2 times 20 plus x. When you, when you expand the bracket, you have that x is 4 plus 0 0.2 x. If we then subtract 0.2x from both sides, we end up with 0.8x is 4. So if we now divide both sides by 0.8, we end up with 4 over 0.8. If we multiply the numerator by 10 and the denominator by 10, we end up with 40 over 80, and that gives us that x is 5. So the ratio of purple to red to blue here yeah, is now 5 to 3 to 17. Now that's the beauty of this method. Anyway, moving on. So now we can find the probability of picking red. So you do 3 over 25 and that's 0 0.12. Okay. Now I hope all that made some sense and please please subscribe and watch some of my other videos. Thank you for watching and bye-bye now. Bye-bye.